Hey YouTube, so real quick, giving you guys a update on my crochet. So it's been about two weeks and this is the way it's looking. Um, so for the first, I guess, couple of weeks, I had my hair, um, I pulled two pieces from the side and I had it pulled back kind of like this for the first two weeks. Um, and then I just took it down and I've been kind of just wearing my, my middle part like this over to the side. I mean, my side part. Um, and then yesterday for church, I did the middle, a middle kind of thing, um, just to kind of see what I really liked or whatever. Um, but yeah, so I'm also giving an update. I mean, it's fine. The hair is actually starting to smell. It's having it's starting to have a little odor, so I think it's about time for it to be washed. And I'll have another video on that if you guys like. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how like I detangle, and I do this like once a week. So I basically just um, I go through like basically ooh, I separate it. Um, I separate them by the braid so for instance this is one braid right here and I'll just separate it all the way down to the braid and see I have the, I'm having to pull them um, I pull gently I try not to pull towards the root just the hair and I'll swoop everything else over so as you can see everything's like this I'll pull everything over and then I'll go through and just kind of detangle pull apart each individual um curl you can see from this side i'll just go through and i'll do each curl and then when i'm done detangling i'll go in with some oil on my scalp because we don't need a dry scalp, especially in the winter. So I use the main choice. Um, I use this growth oil, but this is on the more pricier side. I've also have this Cantu um, tea tree jojoba. What else? Tea tree and jojoba hair and scalp oil I made, which has Jamaican black castor. Um, some other oils, coconut oil. It has a whole bunch of stuff in here. It's like my little concoction that I like to use in between because it's cheaper than these. Um, so I'm actually, I used this one in my hair last and as you can see, I don't really have that much. So I'm probably gonna, I'm gonna go in with the Cantu. Um, this one is really greasy. I, I would use mainly use this one like right before I do a wash or something like that. Um, but yeah, I'm going with this one and I'll go ahead and start with this one.
okay pause so i don't um detangle like the actual like for instance this is one curl i don't detangle the curl and it's you know two separate pieces um i'm not doing that right now only because i can go another um i'll probably do that like right before i decide to wash it only because that process is more tedious and when i get to a certain point i like to just kind of you see the ends right here how it's all like straggly looking if i can't pull them then i'll just grab my scissors and i'll just cut it so you i don't i'm not using hair scissors because this is not real hair it's not coming out of my scalp um. <laughs> process like once or twice a week depending on the week and how much time I have because as you can see this is extremely time consuming that's the reason why I don't separate them you know by the, the individual curl and separate that in two because I'll be here all day um, but I really just really it's a way for me to oil my scalp and to kind of freshen up the curls um, cause you know, they start matting together and looking like a mop instead of curls. I also, you know, when I'm doing it, I like to, as you probably noticed, I like to go and tighten the knot. I don't know why I do it. Don't, it's not really explained why I do it. I just, I just like to, that's my reasoning.
tried to get myself like <laughs> I had to get myself like a little um scalp massage with the scalp massager um for a good like five minutes um just to you know continue to keep my actual hair um healthy um i'll do with my fingers and then i'll stimulate it and that's that that's how i upkeep my hair my crochet my two-week update um and etc the next video you'll see with my crochet would be my um how i wash it um and that should be fun to film. It'll be a different video for me. Um, other than that, uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe.